Welcome everyone to this video. Today we are testing Sophos antivirus and I do have a folder with a bunch of samples of malware. 313 samples in total and so we will be using these samples to see how well Sophos does or does not do as far as protecting us against these specific threats. The procedure will be as follows. In a moment I will enable all of the protections here in Sophos and we will let it sit for just a few minutes to see if it can detect anything on its own. After which we will run a system scan and then if there's any samples remaining after that we will scan the samples folder directly. If there's still samples remaining we will execute them and see if the real time protection can stop them. At this point everything is enabled so we'll go ahead and let it sit for just a few minutes. So far I have not noticed anything pop up. Let's double check our samples folder and it looks like all 313 are still here. So at this point let's go ahead and run a system scan. We're going to let this scan run and we will be back with the results. The scan has completed and it found 136. We can see that it went ahead and cleaned everything out and so let's go ahead and double check our samples folder. We can see that we are down to 59, and it looks like it just removed one because now we're down to 58. Let's go ahead and do a direct scan. We'll let this run, and we are getting additional pop-ups. Let's double check our samples folder again. It looks like we're down to 44. Let's scan directly one more time. And it looks like that found an additional threat. Let's see what we're at now. We're at 43. I did just now notice we have a PNG file in here. They should only be executable files. So we're just going to go ahead and delete this one. That drops us down to 42. So at this point, we're going to go ahead and start execution. After execution, it did remove all of the samples, and so at this point, we're going to go ahead and restart the computer and run some second opinion scans. After restart, I ran a scan with Malwarebytes, which came back clean, no results detected. I ran another scan with MZSoft, which came back clean, no results detected. Those are the results, and you can take them and draw your own conclusions, but that's everything for this video. If you have any comments or questions, please post them down below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please consider sharing it. And if you would like to support the channel, go ahead and hit that join button, the subscribe button, and that bell notification icon to get notifications on future videos. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you have a great day.